Okay, student, let's see what is there in this question. What are the fundamental SI units for angular impulse? So first of all, we must know what angular impulse is. Now, um, as I told you in all my lectures, if you have watched them, uh, there is a, like for every translational concept, there is a corresponding rotational concept. So impulse in translation is defined as F dot delta T, which is actually equal to angular momentum. So in translational motion, we can clearly see that the units for the impulse will be same as that of the unit of momentum. So clearly, in the case of rotational dynamics, what we do, we can just call it angular impulse. This is equal to the change in angular momentum, or we can say it is the product of the torque, um, the product of torque with delta T. So any formula we can use, and this is equal to angular momentum. So there are many formulas for angular momentum. L is equal to I omega. You have to use these formulas. But even now, if we feel like this is difficult, I don't know what is the um, what is the SI unit for moment of inertia. I'm getting confused. So you can choose one particular value because we know that for one Bob system, like there is only one body of mass m which is moving in a circle of radius r with the velocity v, the angular momentum will be given with mvr. So we can clearly find the SI unit from this. Mass is kg, velocity is meter per second, and radius is meter. So it becomes kg meter square per second. This is what is the angular momentum. So kg meter square per second, yes, the answer is b. You can use any formula, any formula, whatever you remember or whatever is given in your data booklet. Like L is equal to I omega, let us give it a try. So moment of inertia will be MR square. Now it's not that it is MR square, MR square is a particular case. Even if you're using a sphere, a cylinder or what, the units will never change. So you can use any formula, whatever you remember. So MR square can be taken as kg meter square and omega is radian per second. So radian is dropped usually. We do not take radian as an SI unit, actually. So radian can be skipped. So L will become kg meter square per second. So you do whatever, but you cannot change the unit. So this is how you do this question. Dear students, thanks for watching the video. Please join the YouTube channel if you want to learn the complete theory of the topic A4 that is already uploaded on the YouTube channel. What are you waiting for? Please become the member on the YouTube channel. All the best.